Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Sprocket yet again, and today I have an idea. We're gonna go ahead and change this tank right here, or this tank destroyer I should say, into something else. I mean, it is still gonna destroy tanks, uh, but we're gonna go ahead and design it in a different way. So as you guys can see, it currently has a long gun. We're gonna go ahead and change that into a very short gun. Uh, and we might also do some other stuff to the hull as well, uh, to make it a little bit lighter, but a little bit more armoured on the front. Anyway, let's get to it, shall we? Okie dokie, so welcome back to another video on my channel. Let's go ahead and start working on this tank. So, what I want to do is, I want to make sure that this thing can destroy tanks from up close, uh, and absolutely annihilate them. So, let's go to armour and figure out where our armour actually is. Uh, and make sure that we have very, very minimal armor in a lot of places. For example, these guys right here. We need to get rid of the armor there. We also need to get rid of the armor here. So, do this. Zero. There you go. It's actually going to be five, but that's fine. Uh, these guys are going to stay pretty well armored. The back end is going to get armor taken away from it. Because we do not need armor there. So, let's go to all of these guys. And get rid of all of that. There we go. The underside is currently 10 millimeters. We do not need it to be 10 millimeters, so it's gonna be five. There we go. Okay, the sides are currently 90. Uh, the sides at the back are actually gonna be 50 instead, uh, and that gets rid of a lot of weight. Uh, at the front, this is 140. Let's go ahead and bring this down to 100. Um, that one can stay 140. That one's definitely gonna stay 140. In fact, actually, let's make this less. Let's make this 100 as well, and there we go. Okay, the sides of this are currently 90. We're going to make those 80 instead, and we're going to do the same thing with the rest of the side pieces. There we go. All of these guys are also going to be 80. Actually, 70. There we go. Essentially, what I need to make sure that happens is that we have the most armor on the front that we can. Uh, I want to be as fast as we can, and I want to be for your gun. So, let's go ahead and try and figure that out, shall we? Uh, yes. So, um, let's go to firepower. Yep. We're going to go ahead and grab this, and we're going to take it off. Okay, excellent. Mantlets, we're going to go ahead and change it for one of these guys, uh, which is going to fit directly on the front like that. Um, this mount is going to have maximum armor. There we go. And the caliber of round is actually going to be 250. I know that's a bit insane. It's very big, but there you go. Um, realistically, we should actually make this, this barrel actually quite long, but what we'll do is we'll make this 0.5, there we go. We'll leave it essentially a lot like this. So instead of a long barrel, we've got a short one. But we've got huge rounds, which should absolutely annihilate the enemy. So, APHE, APHE, there we go. We're also going to go ahead and add some spare ammo as well, because we can. So let's go ahead and whack that into there. Lower it down till it's inside. And there we go. Very nice. In fact, we might as well put it directly above the other ones. There we go. Grab that and grab this and send it forwards. In fact, just grab the bottom ones and send that that way too. There we go. All right, what do we think of this so far? Does the gunner actually work? Yes, they do. Okay, I'm happy. All right, so next thing is livery. We're going to go ahead and try and change the livery. And uh, let's say it's a captured vehicle. So we'll actually get rid of the star and it'll be something else instead. Condition, amazing. Grime, actually a little bit. Uh, hue and saturation are going to go up to 50 again because... Um, that's normal and natural. There we go. And the hue is going to be there. Okay. Yeah, we're going to say that this is actually a British tank. Let's go for it. So, decals. Yes, this guy right here. Let's go ahead and slap this on the side right there. And we'll go ahead and put it on the side up here as well. Because we can. Okay, this is sick. Okay, so I actually really like the way that that looks. However, that is not the end of my changey thingamabobbies. Uh, we're going to go ahead and change it slightly more. So, we're going to extend these guys uh, down from the front, uh, just like so. There we go. Uh, I'm going to bring this guy and this guy forwards. I'm going to bring this guy and the one next to it backwards a little bit. And then we're going to attach this. Bam. There we go. Okay, seems a little bit strange so far, but don't worry about it too much. Leave it there. Let's go ahead and extend these guys sideways. And we're going to have a bulldozer bar thingamabobby. Uh, across the front because I think we can oh it's also gonna come out sideways too so let's go ahead and do this and extend it this way there we go very nice and then we'll do this guy this guy this guy and this guy oh and this one and also that one we're gonna extend all of these guys upwards like so and that is gonna be a lot of extra armor for our tank yeah 
All right, do we want to angle it too? I think I do. There we go. All right, nice. Now we've got like a bulldozer bar on the front as well. This is sick. This is actually really, really cool. However, it weighs far too much now. So what we'll do is we'll go to the back and we'll essentially make this zero armor on the rear because uh, we can. So there you go. Bam. All of the insides are going to be really low too. Go to the other side. Grab this one. And this one. There we go. Let's go ahead and make all of that very, very low. So, like 40, I guess. Yeah, sure. Um, I'm going to go to this side too. That's going to be less. 10. There we go. And I might actually get rid of some of the armor here too. Because it is fully covered. So I think that's fine. Let's drop that down to 50. There we go. And... We'll actually drop this down too. All these guys are only going to be 10. Bam. There we go. Okay, we still haven't managed to actually do the right amount of space, but that's okay. Do we have a radio person? We do. Let's get rid of those. And there we go. All right, I'm happy with this. Okay, so I love adding the bulldozer bars. I think they actually look really, really awesome. And uh, they actually protect us a little bit as well. So that's pretty good. But anyway, what we're going to do now is we're just going to go ahead and go into a fight. And see how well this does. Obviously, we can reload because we have a bunch of rounds in here. Um, that is four, then it's eight. We got eight rounds all together, which is pretty bad, to be fair. But uh, we should be good uh, in the grand scheme of things. So let's go ahead and get ourselves into a scenario and see if we can win. All right, guys, we're in the scenario. There are three of us versus 11 enemies. I do obviously have enough rounds for almost all of them. Um, but hopefully my friendly tanks do a good job as well. Uh, and hopefully they do actually hit their targets, because if they miss, uh, we're going to be in big, big trouble. But, um, yeah, let's go ahead and get ourselves in there and see what kind of damage we can do. Hopefully quite a lot. I'm, I'm assuming we'll be able to do quite a lot here. Um, hopefully we can get over this. Oh, yikes. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, hopefully we can get over this bit, but actually, I think I've built it a little bit too low. Okay, we can fix that. We can totally fix that, actually. So let's go to faces. There we go. Let's go to the underside of this and grab that one, this one, this one, this one, uh, that one, and this one right here. And we're going to move them all up a little bit like so, and that's going to be fine. There we go. Let's go back in. Charge the enemy! It is only a little blade now, though, isn't it? That's tiny. <laughs> it's so small. You know what? I suppose that's why we should really follow the tracks, uh, but never mind. We're going to go ahead and f aim towards wherever that target is. Someone just shot me. I don't know who just shot me. Oh no, my friendly tanks aren't going to be able to shoot properly. I know that they're not. The main reason is because um, we have to turn the whole tank in order to aim the gun side to side. Clearly that's not the best way of doing things. But, are we going to make it this time? Oh, just. Okay, good. Oh, there's some enemies in front of us. Let's see if we can hit it. Alright, here we go. Oh, I missed. Oh no. Okay, change tank. Why is this one so far away? Get in there. Uh oh, we are one tank destroyer down! We are one tank destroyer down, and uh, the other one can't actually hit any shots, uh, just like me. So, we have to aim higher, and fire. I had to aim higher than that. I mean, the explosion is pretty big, but it's not going to win. Um, this is the wrong kind of warfare for this. I need to change, change tactics. You know, I did say we need to change tactics. That's not actually what I meant. Uh, what I did mean is that we need to actually... Oh my goodness. <laughs> we are tanking so many shots. Uh, we need to fight differently. We uh, we wouldn't really go into a scenario where there is 13 enemies pointing at us. But um, yeah, let's aim higher than this guy and see if we can hit him. Here we go. Oh my, it ricocheted off. That round is flying to space. But let's watch it come down, because this is going to be quite funny, actually. All right, here we go. Turn sideways. Can we see it? There it is. There it is. A round is going to fall out of the sky and just explode over there. Ready? There it is. Oh, no. Wait, did it? Did it fall? I'm confused. Okay, well, I'm still tanking rounds. I don't know how this is happening, but it is. Um, I need to change tank to this one. And we're going to use this one to destroy any enemies that come around the side of the other one. Which is right here. Here we go. There we go. That's the kind of kind of kill we want. Nice. Okay. Aim higher and shoot. There we go. Wait, it's on fire, but it's not dead. How is it not killing them? These rounds are massive. These rounds are actually ginormous. But whatever, okay. Um, yeah. 
All right, wrong warfare. Let's do something else. Although, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, um, we might be able to win this one. <laughs> It'll be very, 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 very difficult to do. Oh, no. Now that that one's dead, we can't do anything. The AI in this game like to turn sideways when they uh, don't know what to do. And um, it usually gets my tanks killed. But uh, that's... Yeah, never mind. Okay, we've been tracked. That is the end of us. There's not much else I could do here. I'm going to try... Have I been tracked on the other side? No. Okay, I'm going to... What just happened? They just shot each other. Hey, nice. Okay. I can't actually move anymore. So that is the end of me. Nice. All right, guys. This time we are in crossroads, which means that it is us. Us three. Tank destroyers with mortar gun, round thingamabobbies, and bulldozers. Look at that. It's actually doing its job. Um, we're actually against probably a king tiger. I'm going to assume that that's what we're up against. I'm going to go straight towards it. Okay. <laughs> It is a king tiger and it did destroy me. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're gonna go in with this guy instead. Hopefully, okay, he's just shot my driver. We're gonna go in with this guy instead. <laughs> One after the other because I don't have any radio operators. I think it will tank some rounds. I do think it will tank some rounds, so we should be okay. Maybe. I mean, we might also not be okay, but it looks like he's gonna be fine. All right, let's continue. No, oh, he's dead. Ah, yikes. This is going to take a really good shot for me, and I'm just not very good at practicing with these big rounds. Okay, he's hit me, but I'm okay. We're going to tank it. We're not going to tank it. Turns out it just goes straight through. That is a big yikes. That is a big, big yikes. Oh, is it because of this? Is that where he's hitting me? I don't know. I'm going to go ahead and make that more. Um... Armor? I mean, my armor is, is amazing all the way around this, except behind there, but he's not shooting us there. He's shooting us here. I don't know how it's killing us so quickly. Interesting. All right, we're going to do one more thing. So, go to firepower. Yes. Let's go to this side so we can see it. This is going to be two meters long. This is going to be two meters long. Uh, actually, I tell a lie, 1.5 meters long, maybe? There we go. Okay. Now we've got a long barrel, we should be able to aim a lot nicer. Oh, we see it straight away, actually. I still need to aim higher. Okay. I still need to aim a little bit higher. Okay, where is it? Off to the side. Oh, he's behind a tree, that's why I can't see him. Okay, keep tanking you. Oh, he's not tanking, he's dead. Okay, higher. Higher than that? Oh my goodness. Okay, change round. 16 seconds till I can shoot again. Stay there. Stay there. Stay in the fight. Oh, he's dead. Whenever they start reversing, they die. Okay. Is it going to be able to do it? Is the question. I hit it, but it's not dead. Okay, keep that. And we might be able to do it again. Oh my goodness. This is going to be difficult, isn't it? This is going to be so difficult. Okay, I didn't move the thing, so we're just going to go ahead and shoot straight away. Three, two, one, fire! I hit it, but it didn't die. Wait. Oh, and he's tracked us. How is he tracked us? <laughs> the tracks are legit behind the other tank. I don't know how he's managed to shoot those, uh, but he has. Okay, that's ridiculous. Let's go again. We're going to do it differently this time. I'm just going to go ahead and send it. Unfortunately, my friendly tanks have decided that they are just going to sit there and not do anything. Ah, uh, when you don't have a radio operator, things get really difficult and uh, actually very annoying. Okay, we need to keep track of where this guy is. Whenever he shoots next, we're going over. Okay, we're going to turn towards the enemy. There he is. Aim our gun higher. Sag. All right, one more time. We're going in again. Let's go. Charge the enemy. Yes. Okay, my friendly tanks aren't moving. I just got shot in the face, but I'm still fine. I'm still standing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, my driver's dead, but luckily I can still shoot. It didn't kill him. We got to keep going. <laughs> we got to keep going. My rounds aren't getting through. Oh, no. Oh my goodness! Okay, just as like another test, 
Right, let's load up the other version of this with the smaller gun. Okay, there is still three of us. And let's see if the smaller gun can pen it from here. Okay, you, well, you definitely hit the target, and there's definitely not more pen on it. But it won't go through, will it? Wait, actually, what are the rounds in here? What are the rounds? Are they all APHE? That might be the issue. In fact, that's pretty much the issue. Okay, let's go. Oh my, that round ricocheted really weirdly. Okay. Okay, we hit the target. That should have actually damaged him, actually. Okay, here we go. Fire another one. Okay, that won't have damaged him, but that's okay. Turn it sideways slightly and fire again. Okay, this isn't working. We gotta go in. Okay, I tried to go around the outside, but clearly that didn't work either. Alright, so this thing has a flaw. This whole tank has some sort of flaw. We're gonna go ahead and load up the one with the big gun again. Obviously, it's the one without the big rounds uh, going forwards. Uh, but what we'll do is we'll have the AP, just AP. Okay, no AP HE on this one. The gun itself is gonna be longer. Because honestly, I feel like it should be, maybe, anyway. So, let's go to cannon. Click select. Click cannon. There we go. So this is going to be 2 meters. And then that's going to be 1.5 meters. There we go. Pretty long. That's okay. Propellant length. Actually going to be 550. Or maybe even just 500. Maybe less. And we need it to just fit. So however many it is to actually just fit in there, that's fine. Okay, good. And then we should be good to just go. All right. Remember, I haven't added any extra armor or anything like that. So, this is it. There's the enemy right there. I need to aim higher. Oh, of course I hit the tree right in front of us. Why would I have hit the tree? Okay, there he is. There he is. I need to aim higher than that. Oh, God. Okay. This one can fire next, I think. Okay, aim towards the target. Luckily, that guy is actually missing quite a bit so far, so that's good. We got 12 seconds till we can shoot. All of my guys are actually lined up, so I can just shoot straight away, hopefully. Aim higher. Yes. Okay, this might be it. Three, two, one. Okay, it hit a tree or something? I don't know. It bounced off the top of the tank. Okay, next one is this guy. I'm gonna go sideways. I'm actually gonna go ahead and try and go around the outside while the tiger focuses this guy, maybe. Okay, we've made it over the first one and it is still focusing my friends over there. So this is good. We're still moving in. Excellent. My friends are actually returning fire and that looked pretty accurate, actually. We're gonna aim towards the target. Here we go. Aim higher. Three, two, one. I missed. Okay, reverse. So he doesn't shoot us. We're going to reload, and I'm going to be able to kill him. Okay? I'm going to be able to do it this time. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He switched targets, but not to me. Luckily. Oh, it's so eerily quiet. It is very, very quiet now. Okay, so aim higher, but not too much higher. There. Okay. Three, two, one. How did that not kill the guy? How did it not kill the guy? I have absolutely no idea. Maybe he's run out of ammo anyway. Who knows? All right, I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna drive in. We're going in. Let's go. Okay, guys, driving in has resulted in that. Uh, I, I exploded. Okay. Um, well, it's me versus you, buddy, and you don't seem to be able to see me, so that's good. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna shoot you in the cheek and hope that you die. Six seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Die didn't die. He didn't die. But he still doesn't know where we are, so that's good. But like, ah, this is ridiculous. <laughs> this is utterly ridiculous. All right, nine, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, charge! Yes! Okay, we tanked the first round. Go! Tank the second one, please! Alright, he's turned his gun around. I don't know if he can't see us or something. That's really strange, but... Okay, he isn't aiming at us. He's still not aiming at us. 
We're gonna go around the outside, try and get ourselves in a nice little sneaky position, and shoot him in the side. Okay, here we go. Turn, 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 turn. Uh oh, he's seen us. Okay, he missed. We also missed. Okay, reverse out. Hopefully he can't shoot me properly from there. I think he's gonna try though. I might actually make him make him try and miss the first shot. I'm just gonna go ahead and scoot up there. Uh, hopefully he fires and then I'll reverse, but then we'll go back up again. Is that gonna work? I don't know. We only have like three rounds remaining. This isn't good. Okay, here we go. Four, three, two, one. Peek a little bit, make him shoot. Oh, he can't. He's not actually seeing us here. Interesting. Okay. All right, there you go. Okay, right, he shot. I'm going in. He's gonna shoot again. And I'm gonna die. I didn't die. Okay. <laughs> Just full on shot him in the face, and that didn't work. Okay, I'm in here with you, buddy. Okay, I'm I'm in his gun. Guys. Guys, if only if only I had another tank that was able to shoot him from from the other side. I can't move unless I do this. Oh, I can't even I can't even shoot because I'm stuck. We are slowly, like, falling, so I might be able to get out of this. Let's rev up. Go. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, he's took his shot. I need to just go. Rev up again. Go. He's gonna shoot. He's gonna shoot. As long as it's sort of inside my tank, it won't kill me. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> No, 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 no. Rev up again. Come on. I think the only way I can go is forwards, guys. Unfortunately, this might be the end of us. He didn't shoot. Come on, turn. Okay, he's shot. I need to just go. Turn around. He's going to shoot again straight in my side. That's no good. Ah! <laughs> I tried my best, guys. I tried my best, and this is how it ends up. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we can't actually get through with King Tiger. That is kind of upsetting spaghetti, to be honest. Um, I mean, the only thing that I can think of to change this would be to get rid of some of the rounds. Obviously, go ahead and bring this backwards like this. And then extending the gun. Uh, maybe not the gun itself, but you know. So go to this. Go to that. There we go. Yeah. Make these really big. Okay, firepower, ammunition, one. One each. There we go. And they're going to go there. All right, so it says outside, but we can sort of fit them in. There we go. We're going to squidge them towards the center. We're ready. Oh, actually, wait, 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 wait. We're not fully ready. Cannon. Yes, select this one. It needs to be way bigger. Two meters. Okay, another one. Two meters. There we go. That's how big the barrel needs to be. Okay, where are you at? There you are. Okay, here we go. Aim towards the target. I have a feeling that went through, but it didn't actually kill it. You know? I think it did go through, but it didn't destroy the tank. Oh. It keeps killing my driver. <laughs> it's an issue. Actually, wait a second. Is my driver actually just... Is there now a thing where the drivers are... Uh, or a weak spot or is there actually a plate behind the driver? I can't tell so let's go to armor real quick. Yeah, it's just the plate behind It is just the plate behind okay, so I'm gonna move the driver's seat down to here. There we go I'm gonna get rid of this go Oh, someone's already dead. Okay aim three two one fire Victory there we go. Okay, the one with the really, 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 really long barrel actually works. Okay, so, I just wanted to make sure that this tank could eventually kill. So, that's us. Okay, so, let me know which version of the tank you actually prefer. I really like tanks with bulldozer thingamabobbies on the front, and I might modify some of my other tanks to have those. Um, and then I need to figure out a nice gun to have. Clearly, 250 millimeters isn't the best. 
Like, you can you can actually pen armor on things with obviously less, because um, there is less rounds to go through, uh, which makes sense. Uh, but anyway, I thought it would be a fun video to do something like this. I really like the actual base of this as well, the hull. I think it looks really cool. Uh, but for now, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.